Teach me! Teach me! Teach me! Help me! No! I'm about to lock in. I'm about to lock in. Straight cash, homie. I'm walking in. No! We want much! What episode number is it, Luna? Episode five? No! I will confiscate your butt. Give me that butt. Give me that butt. Let's get it, baby. Episode five. What's good, boys? Hey, good to see you guys. As always, it's episode number five of Wheel of Mud. Gotta say a massive thank you to all of the boys for continuing to support Wheel of Mud. And so far, we've had an absolutely insane season. We've got four wins on the books, and one more win secures us a spot in the playoffs. We've got an offensive line that's slowly improving. We've got the best tight end in the game. We've got one of the best wide receivers in the game. We've got Javante Williams, Jerome Bettis, Jamar Chase, AJ Brown, and Zach Wilson taking over the rest of our offense. On defense, we have one of the best free safeties in the game. We got the best user, in my opinion, in the game, and that's Micah Parsons. We got some solid linebackers as well. Junior Seau, Matthew Judon, Foyasada Luakon. Also got Kyle Hamilton, Steve Atwater, AJ Terrell, Bobby McCain, Caleb Farley, and absolutely no defensive line at all. We also still have a silver kicker, Cade York. I'd like to handle that at some point, too. Slowly but surely, we're gonna build this team exactly as we need it for the Super Bowl. I say we prioritize the line today and unless we absolutely have to take something else. And as you guys know, there's three wheel spins per episode now. So each episode is bigger and badder. Let's see what this first wheel spin can grant us. It's Weddle, ooh. <laughs> yeah, you guys saw a Weddle one earlier, but this is actually a little different. Earlier, it was the amount of guesses it took me to get to the player is how much I got to spend. This is Weddle Unlimited. Weddle Unlimited lets you keep going. It keeps resetting the player over and over and over. So I'm gonna get 10,000 coins per correct guess until I lose. So it's basically a marathon. Until I finally get stumped on a player, I can keep earning 10K at a time. It'll be really self-explanatory here in a second. First guess, let's go AJ Brown. All right, our player's not a wide receiver, nor in the NFC. They're slightly taller than 6'1 and older than 25. That kind of feels like a quarterback to me. So an AFC quarterback. Just go Ryan Tannehill. It is a quarterback. He's definitely too old, but we're on the right track. What about Lamar Jackson? Close, but no. AFC East. Tua? It's the AFC West. So it's either Derek Carr, Russell Wilson, Pat Mahomes, Justin Herbert. I feel like it's Derek Carr. It's not Derek Carr. Wait, is it actually Patrick Mahomes? <laughs> I've never had it be a player so popular. Answer is Patrick Mahomes. All right, so that's 10K. Now we keep going until I lose. So Mahomes, next one is a wide receiver. It's not NFC, so it could be Juju. It's a short wide receiver, really short wide receiver. What if it's Tyreek? <laughs> Oh, is Mahomes back to back with Tyreek? Okay, 20K. Next one's a 25 year old wide receiver in the NFC. Not AJ Brown. Metcalf. Ooh, Amonra. It's the NFC South. Godwin. No. Olave. Oh shit. I've only got three guesses left. I went a little aggressive there. It's an NFC South wide receiver. 5'10 or shorter. What about DJ Moore? This will tell me if it's a Panther or not. It's not a Panther. Oh shit. I have two guesses left. It's a Falcons wide receiver. Wait, could it be Calvin Ridley? It's not. Calvin Ridley. I have one guess left. The only other player I can think of on the Falcons is Olamide Zacchaeus. I don't know anything about him. I don't know his height, weight, age. So that's my last guess. Oh my God. Eighth guess. All right, that's 30K. Damn, that got a lot harder than I wanted it to. All right, so not a wide receiver on this one. Not a quarterback. Maybe a tight end. Hawkinson. We got a tight end. Big tight, big young tight end. Maybe it's Kyle Pitts. It doubled me up with the Falcons. All right, hey, 40K. Swing and a miss on that guess. Okay. It is a 6 4 AFC wide receiver. What about Mike Williams? Oh, I thought that was such a good guess. Um, it's not AFC West or East. What about AFC North? Ooh, could it be T Higgins? Yep, we're cruising. Holy shit, AJ Brown, amazing guess here. Let's go Amonra. Just get out the NFC North. It is the NFC North. Is it Justin Jefferson? It is not. Darnell Mooney. It is Darnell Mooney. 60K. Okay, so our player is AFC. They're 5'10". It's got to be a wide receiver. Let's go Tyree Kill. Let's get the AFC East. They're tw Dude, they literally are Tyree Kill, except they're not Tyree Kill. They're a 5'10 wide receiver, 28 years old. I'm just going to go Deontay Johnson just so I can figure out AFC North. It's not AFC North. Jaguars, Texans, Colts, Titans. What about Christian Kirk? Holy shit, I thought for sure it was going to be Christian Kirk. I got the number right, but I don't know numbers. Uh, Brandon Cooks? Oh, it's Brandon Cooks. I got it. It's Brandon Cooks. I was on guess seven, dude. They got the streak of seven. That's 70K. Let's go Russell Wilson. AFC West. Okay, it is AFC West. That's good, but it's not a quarterback or a wide receiver. 
Let's pretend it's Austin Eckler. I accidentally hit Austin Hooper, but that was my best guess so far. I did not mean to click that, but it gave me tight end. What about Albert O? It's not Albert O. Wait, I already knew Denver. Shit, dumb guess. Not Travis Kelsey. Um, who's the Chargers tight end? Do the Chargers have Hunter Henry? Oh my God, he's still in New England. Why did I think? Oh, he used to be on. It's not Denver case. Oh, it's Darren Waller. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's Darren Waller, you guys. I'm fine. 80k. We're, we're filming right now. Okay, AJ Brown, swing and a miss. Let's go Darren Waller. That was our next guess after last time. It's another AFC West tight end. So it's Travis Kelsey. I am built like that! Okay, so it's an NFC player, not a quarterback. They're five foot nine. Oh my god, it's a super short wide receiver in the NFC North. Let's just do Darnell Mooney to see if it is the Bears. It's not the Bears. So it's a Vikings wide receiver who is five foot nine. Yo, who's that super fast? There's a super fast wide receiver and everybody uses Dan Chisena. It's not the NFC North. Oh my god. God, why did I look at NFC North? I played too much Weddle. I just played too much Weddle. I literally looked at NFC North like that was correct, and it wasn't. It's Rodney Moore. Shit. NFC South, what about Scotty Miller? Oh my God. Our players 28 or 29. Panthers? Robbie Anderson? I don't feel like he's that short, though. The answer was Dami or Bur What team does he even play for right now? Does he play for the Falcons right now? Our streak was nine, so we got 90K to spend on one single player for this team. Let's get a defensive end. Ooh, dude, if I could have upped my streak to like 12, this Chase Young is an amazing card. All right, Quiddy Pay is actually pretty good. I'm gonna keep him in mind. I think at the price we're going, getting an 87 Emmanuel Agba left end for 83,000, probably our best option. He's pretty damn fast. He's got good block shed, good power moves. I think he'll be a beast. That takes us to our second wheel spin. We've got a left end. And we still don't have a right guard or anything else on the D-line. Also a kicker. So all of those are in. I was going to say all of those are options, but instead we get store packs. So we can get three of any packs in the store that cost coins. So I'm going to go Legends Fantasy Pack, then a Pro Star Fantasy Pack, and then a Pro Elite Pack. All right, we're looking for a guard. We could get a left guard and move to right guard. Or D-line. That's what we're looking for right now. That is technically an upgrade. No, it's actually not. I have a gold D-tackle in. I'm getting D-line like I asked for, and they're not good enough. That's a center. I guess I could move him to right guard if I was really picky. Hey, team of the week player. Right end. That's exactly what I need. David Edwards. We have two picks this round. I better not get a good legend, though. I'm gonna be sad if I get a good legend. Nope, that is a horrible legend for us right now. So, we take both of these and fill some voids. That's amazing. Gold kicker. Slightly better than what I've got. And the top for A. We're gonna get campus hero, Garrett Bradbury. He won't actually help me. Darn it. Neither of these guys will, because I just got that David uh, David Edwards, but we'll take it. Oh, I didn't even see this. The preseason team of the week pack guarantees an 83 plus overall team of the week preseason player. Who gives a shit about these fourth string bench players? But regardless, this pack will be good for me. I got a kicker, Justin Reed. That's actually pretty cool. Sorry, Blank and Ship. I love you, but I'm gonna have to go Justin Reed as my kicker. All right, Boys, before we build the squad, let's get our final wheel spin in. This is our third final wheel spin right here. Might be a draft class jackpot. Draft class jackpot. We're gonna have Alexa pick a number. Alexa, pick a number 10 through 22. Here's a number between 10 and 22. It's 11. 11. Was that a good draft class? I'm gonna pull up the 2011 NFL draft class and I can take any single player from this draft class. Fortunately, these guys are gonna be kind of old, but hopefully there's still some studs. First pick was Cam Newton. Second pick was Von Miller. So Von Miller, already an awesome option. Julio Jones, AJ Green, Patrick Peterson. Holy shit, this was a fucking loaded draft. Tyron Smith, J.J. Watt. The first 11 picks were almost all studs. The only bad pick in those first 11 rounds was Jake Locker. So Robert Quinn was in this draft class. He has an 87 overall right end. I think Robert Quinn is actually the move here. We just picked up a lot of edge rushers, 89 power moves, and uh, he's pretty expensive. North Carolina. All right, let's adjust this lineup. So right guard, throw David Edwards in there, 81 overall. That's actually a big upgrade. Now at right end, we can put Robert Quinn. At left end, we can put a Emmanuel Ogba. And we got kicker Justin Reed. All right, so on top of winning today, I would love to get Steve Atwater some upgrades. I've kind of struggled with Atwater. The quicker we get him to that 89, the quicker he's just gonna be a, a fucking monster out there. So let's try and get him there ASAP. That leaves the final thing, which is the Madden 23 challenge wheel. It's spinning right now. Let's see what we've got. It's a hot, ooh. Ah, it's Justin Reed. It's Justin Reed. I actually trust Justin Reed to do this over a kicker. 25 plus yards passing with our kicker. Let's see our opponent's top three. That's my top three. Eric Allen, Derrick Henry, Tim Tebow. Hey, great squad, but we can compete. We're a really good team now, especially after adding the D lineman. Ooh, play action. Throw middle. 
Throw middle. Tebow's trying to take off. We got him. He doesn't run. He might throw underneath to his hat back. I'm on out. What? Oh, at water. Computer at water. Wait, return it. House it. House it at water. House it. Oh my God. That's two. Let's go. Dude, I'm so poverty. The only way I can get Atwater upgrades is when the computer plays as him. I was on Al Woods. Dude, maybe he just figured since I wasn't using, it'd be so easy for him. Well, listen, now that we got an 8-0 lead, if I can stop him here, I'm going to try and get my kicker in ASAP. He's going to go play action here. I'm on Junior Seau. He's got nothing. Don't you throw this. I'm going to try and bait him with Parsons. He wants to throw to number one. Scream over. Oh, shit. That route fucked me. Oh, shit. <gasps> Good D, good D, good D! Dude, look at this edge rush. Michael off the edge. Ooh, Atwater's not in. All right, let's get him in there. Oh! This smothering pass rush, dude. All right, Atwater covering the middle. Does he throw 87? No, oh, good throw. Let's leave something open and bait him. Bait him, bait him, bait him. Hey, let's go. God, I'm so impressed with the pass rush right now. Daddy. Nice route. Oh my god, that just tore me up. All right, hey, good thing. Let's see if I can get a pick or something on the two point. Right here. Right here. Come on. You have to throw it. You have to throw it. You don't have anything. Oh. Somebody just throw a stupid pass and I can pick it. Oh, wait a minute. That's actually so open. Oh. No. He has Fearless, though. Did you see Fearless on Justin Reed? For some reason, Fearless went off. I think what I should utilize with Justin Reed here is rolling out. Oh, wait for X. Wait for X. There he is. Oh, misdirection. Oh, my God. He's so open. Great throw. Great blocks. Let's go. I'm going cross buck. Let's pick it up, baby. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's see if Justin Reed can make a real pass. Damn. I'm going to try to slip screen again. Oh, he's there. Great throw. I set those blocks up. Okay. 17 yards for Justin Reed. Fourth and 10. He's going to call a timeout. He killed me with five wide. I'm going to give him a taste of his own medicine. I'm going to deliver a laser. Dude, you have to be kidding me. Run that back. Look at how fucking quick. Ah, why are we rewarding you, Sir D-Lineman? Honestly, you know what? Good job. That was an insane move. I can't believe he did that. All right, Cut. hit low, hit low. He came through so fast, I couldn't have thrown anybody even if I really wanted to. Oh, RB, 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 RB. Ugh. Wait, go in, go in. All right, at least I get an opportunity to score again because if he had, not, he had gone down right there, he could have milked the clock and then scored. Atwater, let's get one more. Let's get you fully maxed. Let's go. I right, wait, pick, pick two. Go Atwater. Oh, you're so slow. He's an 81 overall. He's so slow. What a play, though. What a play. That's three upgrades, Atwater. I don't care if that's not an interception on the stat sheet. That's an interception. Is this man coverage? It's not, which means that's open. Oh, yes, sir. Tony G fucking ruined him. Let's go. Ah, out of bounds would have been nice. I didn't have to use this timeout. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. Thank God I got that off and out of bounds. He switched his zone at the right time. All right, I will take the kick. Dude, how nice would it have been if Atwater was already upgraded though? And he could have fully returned that. He totally would have if he had more speed. Reed's four for six, 21 yards. Let's go slip screen and just get four. I'm really surprised he's not like all out fucking sending for that. Come on, blocks, blocks. Hey, hey, I'll run one more with him just to be a dickhead. I'm gonna run one more with him. Look at Javante, look at Javante, look at Javante. Dude, Justin Reed, plan your fucking heart out, man. All right, this looks very open on the left side. He's user D-line, so should have good blocks here. Yes, sir, get inside. Oh, all the way! Come on, come on! Damn! Javante's kind of slow, too, I'm not gonna lie. All right, we're gonna go a play action deep, deep shot here. Hold those blocks, yes, sir. Hold on to him, hold on to him. Let's go, sketchy! Got him! AJ Brown! Are you kidding me? AJ Brown! Let's get the two point. Jamar Chase. Am I, did I max Atwater? No, he needs one more upgrade to be maxed. Do it all in one video. Ooh, the corner route's not there this time. Dude, this guy's got the laser beams. Ah! Come on, Al Woods, baby. Ooh, we're there, Seau. Tebow's slinging, dude. I'm gonna send a blitz. Get to the tight end. I'm there. I'm there. I'm there. Let's go. All right. I'm going to look for the pass to the halfback. He might just try and get something little, a weak little pass to Barry. Yep. Just looking for it. Fumble! Get on it! My 
my god! Go! Go! Wait, where's Steve Atwater? You think Steve Atwater's behind me? You are so dumb. You are really dumb. This guy probably thinks I'm being a dick, but honestly, I just wanted my Atwater buckets, you know? Ah! Nobody even tried to block him. All right, Zach, let's just keep gunslinging, baby. Wait, skirt, skirt, got him. X, no way! No way! No way! Bro, that might have been one of the nasty things I've ever done. How the fuck did he make that throw? That is 77 overall gold Zach Wilson. Dude, I was spooked there for a second. This game is officially over. Let's solidify this win. I don't want to say that I won off the fumble. Let's make sure he knows. Dude, this guy legitimately throws laser beams. I'm going for the sack with that water. <gasps> Got it! Oh my god! That's four. That's two interceptions, a touchdown, and a sack, and one game. Guess pass, and then Terrell. This is cross drag again, but we can actually clamp it now. I'm not fast enough. Get there! Oh, the halfback, the halfback, the halfback. I have not missed a single two-point conversion. He has missed every single one. It's a nine point swing. Got him again, dude. He literally can't get these. He goes the onside and who else but Atwater to pick it up. Look who's back in at quarterback, Justin Reed. Let's hand this ball off. Oh my God, daylight. He rushes 45 yards. Let me see the stats though. Let me see the stats. Let me see the stats, please. Here is conceded the game. I'm definitely not counting that one as a rage quit. There's a two possession game with two minutes left. He just wants to get to the dashboard quicker. So I won't count that one as a rage quit, but what I will count is two things. Number one, as you can see, we advance to the playoffs. We have one loss until elimination, two wins to the Super Bowl. Of course, I do have my challenge wheel. So let's hammer out the challenge wheel before we go anywhere else. So for completing my challenge, I get one of any pack in the store that costs coins. I'm gonna go Legends Fantasy Pack. I feel like this gives me the best odds to hit like a true Hail Mary, just get some crazy card. Tony Fields, Kenyon Drake, DJ Chark, we got Junior Starnet. I have you already. It's good mojo for this topper round. We got a court elite, Cameron Curl. Fortunately, can't really get much out of that. Quinn and Williams, we can absolutely get something out of that. At an elite D tackle, and our Legends player is gonna be 81 Deacon Jones, who technically I can get something out of too. I think I can move to my secondary D tackle. Challenge rule, thank you very much. Let's put Quinn and Williams in as our starting D tackle. And my backup D tackle can still be Al Woods, actually. Al Woods played really well, so I want him in there. I think we fucking maxed out Atwater. One, two, three, four. Interception on a two point, a pick six, which is an interception and a touchdown, and a sack for Steve Atwater. One upgrade, two upgrade. All right, now we need 87 Atwater. 459,000, holy shit. This is like a million coin card. And the final upgrade, baby! Steve Atwater! I saw we got him right there, baby. Definitely gonna go universal on him. He has a ton of ability slots. We can get mid-zone KO for one AP. I'm actually gonna go crusher on Steve Atwater. Heavy ball carry fatigue on hit stick tackle. So we're just gonna light people up with Atwater. The more we do that, higher chance they fumble. Since I'm always usering him, I'll just go recuperation. 6'3", 217, 87 speed, 87 excel, 90 hit power, crazy good zone coverage. If I can set a goal for next episode, it's getting an inside stuff to tackle. That's going to help stop the run a lot. And for the playoffs too, I'd like a backup tight end. I'd like a stronger interior O-line. It's not that good. Wide receivers I love. I'm not going to mess with my wide receivers. Holy shit, boys. We may actually be ready for the playoffs. All right, boys. I love you. I'll see you in the next episode, which is the debut of our playoff run, our first ever playoff game. It came quick. I told you. Just like me. All right. I love you, boys. Thanks for penetrating so deeply into this video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.